What's up guys, this is Nathan from Next Gen Tutorials and as requested in the comments um, I'm gonna show you guys how to add extra agents to Plex. Now in this particular video I'll be adding an extra subtitle agent. Why? Because um, it'll increase the chances of finding subtitles for your videos by a lot and with a lot I mean I had 28 options of subtitles to choose from when I was watching Breaking Bad. So yeah, that's <clears throat> that's a lot. So let's get right to it. And first of all, I'll put a link in the description to this site. This is where the Potnap PC subtitle pinned dot bundle is, and you can download it simply by let's close these tabs. I don't need them clicking download zip so if you open the link and you go to download zip there you go oh as you can see I've already downloaded it let's make that screen a little smaller I'll place it right here on the desktop so it's easy to find back I open it up and this is the folder we need so let's put that back on the desktop and it's really simple actually you just go to your Plex media options and you open the plugin folder now now that we have the plugin folder as you can tell these two here those are the Potnap PC subtitle bundles already in there you won't have them in there yet the only thing you have to do is take the one from your desktop slide it in here and release it that's it then it will work but since I've had some issues in the past um, what I've done is I put in the bundle uh, master name and I've changed I copied it paste it and deleted master and this and the little stripe here just so because all the other ones they don't have master behind it um, I've noticed if I leave one of them out, sometimes I have good results, sometimes I don't have good results. So I put them both in, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't screw things up, but I suggest you do the same and also do it on all of your um, devices. Like for example, this is my gaming laptop, but I have my media server next to me which is connected to my TV and I I've done it for that one as well so I'm sure that everywhere I look I'll have the subtitles available to me this will also be available uh, well it will also look for subtitles and make them available on mobile devices so you don't have to figure out a way how to add bundles on your mobile device because that's not necessary it will just use the ones on your server that's hosting the TV shows or movies. So uh, once you've done this, you double click your media manager and this is something I've shown you in the previous video. You go to your agents and you have to make sure that you click them on. So as you can see those are turned on. Open subtitles and Potnapsi movie subtitles as well. They're both turned on standard I think they'll be turned off so you want to make sure you turn those on uh, same for your TV shows just go to the TV database and you'll see both of them appearing so if you didn't add them correctly you won't see one of the two so you have to make sure that you do that correctly and that's it that's really all that is to it you can look for other um, agents as well on on the internet I'm sure you can find some more or some different ones uh, to make your Plex movie experience or TV show experience that much nicer but for the subtitles this is it just uh, open the link in the description do as I say and you'll have even more subtitles added to your movies and TV shows so I hope you guys enjoyed and learned something from this if you did please like and subscribe it would help me out a lot and that's it. See you guys later. Bye-bye.